Hello my lovers and welcome back to another speed video. Welcome back guys to my YouTube channel. I hope you had an amazing day. This is the last build in the row. This street is finally done. Um, you had a chance in previous video to watch this library slash townhouses and this time we are making um a cafe so i really wanted something really really cozy for this save file by the way if you uh didn't know i am making a save file with my dear fellow um uh, simmer create for sims and uh we are renovating this willow creek world uh, base game world of course but um in this save file we are practically using <laughs> everything uh but just because um i don't know somehow uh, the last save file that i did um like a collaboration was very uh pack restricted so yeah we really wanted to give this a go and uh use um at least you know now nah, i don't want to say any, everything but uh the packs that we really do love and um think that go so well with this save file so this save file is basically very inspired by autumn and that cozy vibes and everything in the save file it's extremely uh, cute and cozy and so freaking nice for the gameplay um i have one more build to show you and that is a little bit different i have to admit and then after that one i'm going to make a tour and show you guys the whole world and i believe september of 9 it's the day of the release this when we are going to release this um, save file so yeah uh talking about the cafe so i was thinking about making a nightclub but somehow i didn't know how to do that and also how to fit that kind of a vibe into this world so i ended up with a restaurant and also this cafe i think it's better because you have other worlds and i also have and create for sim also have um you know nightclub uh, to share with you you can find it on you know our galleries if you want to download something to play with but also from the other simmers it doesn't matter but still um i really didn't want the nightclub over here i think this it's more appropriate than the nightclub um somehow the whole story behind this save file and the um, overall vibes are totally different and that's the reason why we decided to go with this and also since we only have four lots in this like in this street um i think it's better to to you know make um a lot that you can actually use um uh, we also thought making a little bit i don't want to say crazier things more interesting lots and uh, we could go with a more aesthetic um you know stories but um uh, who is going to play with something that it's not functional i mean you can go with a lot of like stores and make it this more like um i think even like this this uh, this really looks like it's a, a real street and looks so livable you know and that's the reason why i decided to go with more realistic approach and um not like you know a more aesthetic one um even like this looks very aesthetic looks really realistic but um somehow when we are talking about this game in general people will probably be more pleased with 
this kind of a situation more than just aesthetic because you actually want something that you can use and not just like a watch because I often I am a builder that you can actually uh, rely on when it comes to the functionality and also um, the aesthetic so, so when I'm building um, a lot like this I am more about the functionality than the aesthetic yeah maybe it's not reasonable enough um, but somehow I felt like it's better to to go with this and that's the reason I, I'm saying this because of this um, small like a uh, pergola gazebo situation um, in cafes this is not a functional thing but you had a chance to see at the beginning that people are actually use people oh my god the sims are actually using this uh, part of the cafe I don't know how I don't know why and I also really wanted to add something for the kids guys um, I know that they are probably not by autonomy they are not going to use this like a small playground uh, for the kids but still um, if they are using this small gazebo situation they're probably going to use uh, this playground as well um, because I test this cafe and restaurant so much I really wanted to be sure that everything goes smoothly and to be very functional because this is kind of a build that you uh, are going to use a lot and I really push myself to the boundaries oh my god it was crazy I really didn't want to use a lot of tables a lot of clutter um, may probably for someone this could be extremely empty but like I said when it comes to the game performance it's better like this and you have enough space believe me um, uh, for everything that you need so yeah I I'm so freaking happy I'm so in love with this cafe um, and also you have a lot of greenery around this um, cafe and in this cafe and that's the reason why I call this um, a garden cafe because not only you can use this uh, in the autumn you can also use this in every single season and you can always have this cute green um, aesthetic over here if you love that um, I could go with more modern you know approach but somehow I when I saw what the Alexandra did with the um, you know surroundings and the whole this exterior with a tool mod I decided to to go with something very cozy and oh my god I am finishing up guys I hope you enjoy in this um, a little cafe if you did uh, please like this video and I will see you next time I love you all and bye bye